Welcome to the 5D Academy of Higher Consciousness. I'm uh, broadcasting live from Los Angeles. Today's topic we're gonna, uh, is about life's moments are not horizontal, they're vertical. People believe that life and it's our experience and it's our perception, which is completely, it's an optical illusion, it's not real. It's completely false, but it appears to be that way. And we believe that life's moments are connected to each other. You believe that you have a past. You believe that you're living in a continuum. So your experience or your belief of your experience is that you, in your mind, your past is a big story. You carry it with you preciously and you suffer from it most of your life because the past gets collected in this garbage bag. And we keep carrying this garbage bag with us and the garbage bag gets heavier and heavier. And we like to stop every once in a while and dig into our garbage bag and find some rotten food and we eat that food. So every once in a while you stop, you put your garbage bag down, you open it and you start digging inside of it and you find a rotten piece of salmon from four weeks ago and there's maggots on it and it's already rottening and you eat it and then you feel like shit and you puke and you get sick and you feel really bad and you hate it. Well, if you don't want to feel like shit, stop digging into the past and eating rotten food. Don't go to your past. Stay here in presence. Eat fresh food. Eat fresh. Don't eat rotten food. Means stay here. Be here in this moment. Don't go anywhere else. And if you go in the future, it's the same story. You're still in your past. Because future, basically, it's a projection of the mind projecting a past experience into the future. There's no such a thing as future. It just doesn't exist. It's a non-existing element that we either fear, worry about it, or we dwell in it. But basically, that's happening in our past. We're bringing the past to the future. Because whatever you're worried and you fear from, or dwell on, or you're imagining, it's a product of your mind that coming from a past experience, a story from the past, that you're projecting it in here and now into an imaginary moment in the future. That's how it is. Because the moments in this life happen so quickly and they're so close to each other, the moments of life are not horizontal. They're not happening. You're not in a continuum from the past to the present to the future. You're not running into a linear line. The moments, each moment is an independent moment. Every moment is an independent moment that happens only one time. So this is one, one moment, the next moment, the next moment, the next moment, the next moment. They're next to each other like that. Each moment happens and it's over. And then the next, the next, the next. 
but they're not connected, they're not attached to each other. There's a little gap in between the moments. But since the moment's happening very quickly, it's very, very fast, one happens after the other, it creates the illusion of continuity. It looks like you are moving through it. It's just like the reel in the movie theater, they're using reels. These reel is, that's why they call it movies. They call it movies because the reel, all these, the, the, when you're watching a movie basically, it's a series of photographs. So they have photographed a person. So this is one photo, another photo, another photo, another photo, another photo, another photo, another photo. And since they're very close to each other, and when you're moving it, it looks like the person is moving. So they have taken 100,000 photographs, and these photographs, when you start moving it, it creates the illusion that the person is moving. That's how movies, that's why they call it the movie. Yes, Karen. Uh, yeah, you, you. Yeah, I want. I want to ask. You know, today I talked to a friend uh, on the phone, and we haven't been talking for many, many years, right? And then she asked me, "Yeah, what have happened in your life, right?" And then I tell her about different moments, right? And I tell her about. Uh, yeah, happy moments and difficult moments, but it, 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 for me, it didn't feel like I was eating rotten food. I was just telling about this uh, pictures, right? right? So it, it doesn't create an anxiety or it doesn't make me dwelling or anything like that. Okay, are you asking me a question or you're just sharing your thoughts with me? No, uh, I'm asking a question. Okay, what, it, is, what is your question? Yeah, the question is that because you say, don't go to the past, right? It is like right. eating rotten food. Yes. But my experience is that when I tell her about these moments, right? It doesn't feel like eating rotten food. But do, do you mean that it's rotten food anyhow? Okay, I'll get into that. That's a good question. Let me, let me finish what I was saying and then we'll talk about it, okay? Yeah. So, that's a good one. We're going to talk about this because this is what most people on the planet are struggling with. So, and most people are suffering because of this. So, hopefully by the end of today, I will put some light on it and help you to eradicate the source of your suffering for good if you're attentive to it. So the bottom line is that every single moment in life is independent and is not connected to the previous moment or the future moment. It only happens one time. So, where is a minute ago? Can anybody bring a minute ago here right now? Where is two seconds ago? Five seconds ago? Where did it go? 